our fourth story in the top five tonight, a hands-free navigation device, but this one you see, not here. Plus, look at this. Got room for the treadmill in your home? Well, Jay McFarland tells us how this one's different in tonight's browser. All right, we'll start off today with this new type of treadmill. You can walk on it any direction you want, north, south, east, west, you can change directions. And you might be thinking, why in the world would I want something like this? The idea is you would put on a virtual reality headset and you'd be able to walk or run through an entire virtual wor world and get the exercise and everything involved but you're really just standing in one place. So that is very cool. Also this, this is a solar powered bike lock. And I was thinking, why do I need a powered bike lock? Well, this one does all kinds of things. It lets you use keyless entry from your phone to unlock it so nobody else can do that. But it also has an accelerometer, so it will warn you if somebody is messing with your bike. Not only that, if you're riding along and you fall down, It'll send a message to your phone and it'll say, hey, are you all right? If you say you're all right, then it'll leave you alone. If you don't answer, it will assume something bad happened to you and it will notify your loved ones and it will tell them where you last were when you had that accident. So that's very cool. And then finally this, with the new laws in the state of Utah when it comes to texting while driving, you might wanna look at this app. It's called Hudway, it's free, works for your iPhone and your Android. It displays your navigation settings, but it does so in order to reflect off your windshield. So you put this up on your dashboard and it reflects from your windshield, kind of gives you a heads up display, and you can see it can overlay right over the road where you're driving and give you those directions completely hands-free. Again, that's called Hudway Free in the iPhone and Android App Store. All right, that's it from the browsers, now back to you. All right, Jay, thanks.